What is going on people? It's Matt from Liquid Loans and in this quick take video, we're gonna get into some Pulse Chain updates. So with no further ado, let's go. So back in the park for a quick walk and talk video, the best days of the summer are unfortunately behind us. The autumn is here or the fall as you guys call it in America. But you know what? It's been raining quite a lot and the grass really needs it. The grass really needs a good watering. If you're from the UK, you'll get that joke. We always say that to, uh, you know, be stoic about the bad weather and the, and the rain. We say, yeah, the grass really needs it, so it's fine. But anyway, let's get into the video because I want to address Richard Hart's talk to the PulseCon guys. He addressed them via a live stream earlier this week and he talked about some of the updates with PulseChain, about the mainnet, when are we gonna see a mainnet and all that good stuff. First off, he said things are going well, the devs are working hard, and they're about to implement limit orders on PulseX, which is quite exciting. Uh, limit orders are always a good thing on DEXs. If you've used Matcha XYZ or One Inch, maybe you know how to set limit orders. They can be very good because they're gasless and you don't move the price against yourself. So that's good. He's also talking about how they've been finding bugs, ironing out the creases with that, actually finding bugs on the BSC network that even their devs didn't know about. So that sounds positive. And really, all they're waiting for is consensus. So things are moving in the right direction for sure. Obviously, it feels slow. We've been in this holding pattern for well over a year. And I want to talk about how we can be lulled into a false sense of security, thinking things are going to be like this forever, right? It feels like we're always waiting for the mainnet. It went, it's never going to get here. There's been some FUD, some people doubting if we're ever going to see the Pulse Chain mainnet. And that's untrue because everything in life changes. Everything is in flux. For example, yesterday here in the UK, uh, the Queen of the UK passed away and I'm far from a royalist, but it's still weird, right? My whole life, all I've ever known is the Queen as the head of state of the UK. In fact, she ascended the throne even before my parents were born. So most people in the UK, all they've ever known is the Queen. And we've been lulled into a false sense of security that she'll be here forever. She'll always be the Queen. She'll always be the head of state. And then bang, we wake up this morning, she passed away yesterday, we have a new king and everything has changed. And on a microcosm, on a micro scale, that's the same with Pulse Chain. We're gonna wake up one day, we're gonna have a full live mainnet and all these great protocols, Pulse Chain, PulseX, Liquid Loans, a hundred more protocols. So what I wanna to touch on is it's coming, don't fud yourself out, even though it's taken much longer than we wanted, expected, hoped. Things are moving in the right direction, Richard gave an update and hopefully we see a mainnet by the end of 2022. Anyway guys, I thought I'd come to the park to touch on that topic today. If you like content like this, do hit that subscribe button and that bell icon so you're notified every time we drop new content. Thanks for watching and I will see you on the next one. Peace.